very heavy duty, heavy and duty. It's got a job to do.
Now that is handy. Check how the machine is calibrating the X and the Y offset for both sides. Load filament. How do these work, these PTFE tubes? Because nowhere in the instructions I saw to attach it to this little thing. And also when you are, how, how, like this or like this, just press it in here. How does that run? Or do I need to leave it like this? How is this going to work? Like that? It's nowhere in the instructions and also not here. Let's uh, go to load. How to load filament. Yeah, that I wanna know. Step one, remove the top panel, done. Step two, hang the filament onto the filament holder and feed the filament into the filament entry until, until it pollutes from the other end of the tube. There we go, the other one as well. I hope everybody can see it. Okay, so, done. Step three, push the, what, huh? Push the throttle backwards and hold. Then insert the filament into the extruder until you feel resistance taking the left extruder, for example. This one goes, oh, we can now pull on it. it. Goes in here, then hold it backwards until. Oh yeah, I feel, I feel something. So here we do the same thing, put it in, hold it back. I feel resistance. Okay, step four, set the target, temperature, and tap heat. And then step six, when the filament oozes out of the nozzle, tap stop loading. Stop loading. Now what? Insert the guide tube into the extruder, and when it snaps into the tube clip, finally reinstall the top panel. It's supposed to snap in before or after the thing here. Where do I need to tap? It should snap in like that. Okay. Oh, did snap in. Well, it is PLA, so I'm not going to put the top cover on it. Well, let's see what is going to happen, right? Shall we? And we got ourselves a failed print. Probably because of something I have missed or didn't do, but so far, a failed print. Ooh, check this out. The PTFE tube came loose. Hmm, that one is still in there. This is a little bit dumb. Maybe I did something wrong. Uh, let's check how I can fix this. And the print is ready. Let's uh, let's check it out. Press the screen. So you need to get it loose. They say here, if the four squares can be broken off, not necessarily completely, then the X Y offset calibration is successful. If not, then um, it's it's not okay. Complete. Uh, let's do this one. Fulfillment. It's already loaded. This is also 50 minutes. Let's see how that is going to work. And also this model is printed and check this out. This is looking very nice. So now that this one is ready, I need to choose 
from one of those four layers or yeah four layers which one is the best here it says which one to choose next and i'm going to check which one i think looks the best it's a it's a very nice sturdy model it's looking cool i think that this one looks the best next choose for the x model i think this one next complete wizard complete complete and there you have it everything is done this is in the menu by settings firmware update current version is 2.2.19 and now it's going to update to 2.3.6 so update it's going back to chinese okay complete oh it's still okay okay so all set to uh, start printing my first model so as you can see it is printing really fast i didn't speed anything up it is just how fast it is going this is a uh, test benji in a default mode just one benji being printed and we have a printed game of the build plate I have tried, I have tried to let this print continue, but eventually it popped off the build plate. Here it says 100%, but it is still printing. How is that possible? If you are still watching this video, thank you, you are amazing. If you didn't know that, now you know. There are many ways to support this channel. One is liking or subscribing if you are not subscribed yet. You can also give one time a thanks to support this channel financially. There's something like a YouTube channel membership. You will, your name will be mentioned right over there or you know, support me on Patreon. Link is in the description of this video. I also do some gaming live streaming on twitch.tv slash Zachary's world. I play a lot of Minecraft. You can also check me out on EasyZag YouTube channel. I will post almost every week a brand new video about games that I like to play. I'm not going to say anything about it, but you can guess already what I'm playing. Anyways, that is it for this video. I will see you next time. Peace. Bye-bye.